by Clemente Leasing, New York, NY, February 13, 2023, U.S. Soccer Players. The recently concluded window will have a huge impact on the second half of the club's season across Europe's domestic leagues. It will also impact the Champions League, which returns on Tuesday with the start of the knockout phase following the long winter break. In the race's three club competitions, Champions League, Europa League, and Europa Conference League, teams entering the knockout phase are allowed to register a maximum of three new eligible players. Since the 2018-19 season, it no longer matters whether those players had already played in the competition for another club. That has made the winter transfer window an even bigger deal as the past few weeks have proven. FIFA said the four, 387 international transfers that took place during the January window represented an all-time high since soccer's international body started tracking the moves in 2010. English clubs topped the spending list with a total of $898, 6 million, 57% of the overall spending that took place globally, followed by French clubs who, at over $130 million according to Transfermarkt, were a distant second. This takes us to how all these roster changes and spending will affect the Champions League. While the knockout stage of the UCL is always a riveting and tense part of the season, the list of new names and players who have changed teams will likely make it even more interesting than usual. You can't start that analysis without taking a deeper look at Chelsea, who again according to Transfermarkt have spent over $600 million on 16 signings this season if you include last summer's transfer window and the winter one that just concluded. Among those signings are midfielder Enzo Fernandez, who helped Argentina win the World Cup this past December. The now former Benfica player was purchased by Chelsea on January 31st, on the final day of the January window, and could very well be instrumental for the team both in the Premier League and in the UCL. Chelsea, who take on Borussia Dortmund on Wednesday in the round of 16 at Stamford Bridge, has included strikers Joao Felix and Mihailo Mudrik on the 25-player roster UEFA required teams to submit by February 2nd. Like Fernandez, Felix and Mudrik are expected to ignite Chelsea's attack and score the goals needed to go far in the competition. Not included were fellow January signings Noni Maduki, Benoit Radiasho, David Dotter of Fofana, and Andre Santos. As a result, striker Pierre Marek Obama Young was also left off the UCL roster in order to make room for the bevy of new stars the team signed over the past few weeks. Chelsea is building for the feature with a night towards 2023-24, but they will also be playing to win in Europe this season while trying to move up the table in the Premier League. Since the Champions League is at the knockout stage, anything can happen. 